Hello there. You've probably noticed the weather not really changing very much over recent times, and that's because high pressure has been firmly dominating. And with high pressure around, it's not rained very much anywhere. But in Warwickshire and Church Lawford, you have to go back to the 11th of May. That was the last time it rained, so that's nearly four weeks of dry weather. Some of the warmest weather has been across in Northern Ireland, County Tyrone. It's been very warm in Castle Dirk for the last nine days, but five of these recent days have seen temperatures reach 24 degrees. That's six above average. Now, as the west that had the high temperatures again on Tuesday but England stuck underneath this area of cloud had much lower temperatures in many areas uh, for example in Leek and Staffordshire 18 degrees on Monday 12 degrees on Tuesday we also had some cloud dropping the temperatures in parts of West Scotland as well uh, Carol's <laughs> going to entertain us with a song as well good morning <laughs> <laughs> no, I certainly won't be doing that, John. I'll save your ears from that torture. Good morning, everybody. This morning is very similar, actually, to how we started the day yesterday, in that it's fairly cloudy. There's a little bit of drizzle coming out of that cloud. And through the day, perhaps a bit quicker than yesterday, the cloud will thin and break and push back towards the east coast. And more of us will see some sunshine. And our photo of the day is from Kerry Baker, who captured this shot of the White Cliffs at Botany Bay. Tell you what else is a sign. Here's our Carol. We're going to get a weather forecast. That's what it's a sign for. Morning, Carol. <laughs> Good morning, both. Good morning to you, too. Well, the weather today is very similar to what we had yesterday to start with. It's a cloudy start, as you can see from one of our Weather Watchers pictures in Lincolnshire. But it's a sunny one as we push too far the west. As you can see in Devon, sun already well and truly up. Good morning both. Good morning to you too. I'm going to start today with the pollen levels because as you can see across much of England and all of Wales they're either high or very high and we're talking grass pollen and whilst we're talking levels these are the UV levels today moderate or high across the board so if you're out in the sunshine certainly do bear that in mind and some of us are starting with some sunshine as you can see from our weather watcher bubbles in Swanage. Stay there Carol. You ready? Oh no, is it the recorders? Oh. 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 <laughs> That's not bad. You know those West Ham fans who were singing earlier? I think we just beat them. That, that was London's <laughs> burning, Carol. Was it any good? Be kind. Actually, do you know what? I thought it was going to be rubbish. You really surprised me. It was brilliant. Oh, well stop it. It was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> it really wasn't, was it? Uh, but we tried. We tried. <laughs> we tried. Uh, recorders, of course. I mean, bands like Led Zeppelin, the Beatles, they've all used the recorder Are on their tracks. Are you sure? Tracks. Yes, absolutely. Are you we... just saying that because it says it there? Yes. Did the Beatles use the recorder? <laughs> We're going to get inundated now. We've with... all played the at school it used to be you know standard fare wasn't it every morning oh do you remember that yeah anyway cheatham school of music says there are 80 percent fewer students <laughs> learning to play compared with a decade ago but love it or loathe it a recorded rendition of despacito by justin bieber did impress <laughs> the judges on britain's got talent